Today, we're diving into the world of the legendary artist, Rembrandt. Born in the Netherlands in the 17th century, Rembrandt van Rijn experienced a life full of ups and downs, and these experiences greatly influenced his stunning artworks. One of Rembrandt's notable works is the Finding of Moses from the 1630s. This masterpiece showcases his impeccable talent for capturing emotion and storytelling. It's like his inviting us to witness the incredible moment when Moses was discovered in the reeds. Another remarkable piece is the abduction of Proserpina created between 1631 and 1632. Rembrandt's brushstrokes and use of light and shadow create a dramatic atmosphere that draws us into the mythological story of Proserpina's kidnapping. Let's not forget about the captivating portraits that Rembrandt is famous for. Old Man with a Gold Chain and Old Man with a Beard both painted in 1631, reveal Rembrandt's incredible ability to capture the essence of his subjects. The deeply lined faces convey wisdom and character that makes us pause and reflect. In St. Peter in Prison from 1631, Rembrandt's use of light showcases his mastery of chiaroscuro. The contrasting light and darkness bring out the emotions of St. Peter's predicament, as if we're right there in the cell with him. Minerva, also painted in 1631, is a classic example of Rembrandt's fascination with historical and mythological themes. The intricate details and vibrant colors transport us to ancient times, allowing us to connect with the goddess of wisdom and courage. On a more personal note, Rembrandt painted the prophetess Anna, also known as Rembrandt's mother, in 1631. This poignant piece reflects his deep admiration and love for his own mother. The tender expression in her eyes reminds us of the universal bond between a child and their parent. Rembrandt's talent for capturing the essence of people is further highlighted in his portraits such as Young Man and Portrait of Nikolai's Rutz both from 1631. With each stroke of his brush, Rembrandt makes us feel like we are truly looking into the souls of his subjects. Last but not least, we have Young Man from 1630-35. This portrait showcases Rembrandt's evolving style as he experiment with different techniques. The subject's youthful gaze and delicate features are captured with a level of skill that only Rembrandt possessed.